Well, uh, off of what the way his last postseason, went, you know, his last postseason game went, but the game before that was exactly like tonight. I mean, his postseason, he's had one bad start and two tremendous starts, but uh, tonight was everything we expected Johnny to be. Uh, he was on the ta on the attack. He kept the ball down. He changed speeds. Um, you know, it was just a spectacular performance by him. On the far right aisle. Ned, what about your lineup these last two games against Matt and then against the Grom? Have, as you guys get through the third time in the order, that you guys are able to adjust and kind of pounce on them? Well, we don't we don't swing and miss. We put the ball in play, and we find ways to you know just keep putting the ball in play, keep putting the ball in play until you find holes. We had an opportunity in the fourth inning, and couldn't capitalize on. It. In the fifth inning, we did. You know, we got guys on, and guys just kept the line moving, kept finding ways to. Uh, you know, find holes out there. Okay, right in front. Oh. How close were you to trying to review the the play at first, where uh, not Haas close. got pulled? Not not close no. at all. You could tell right away. No, right away. Did you? I mean, you have a feeling about guys before. Did you get a feeling Johnny was going to be like this tonight? Or? Yes. Yes, I felt. You know, Johnny. Johnny thrives in this environment. He's comfortable in this park. He loves our fans. He feeds off their energy. Uh, you know, and I just felt very, very strongly that he was going to put up a great performance, and he did. And in the row behind him, Eric? Ned, at what point did you feel a complete game was a possibility for him? When we scored three runs in the ninth. Um, I was going to send I was gonna send Wade. I wasn't going to, you know. Johnny had done his job at that point, and, you know, in a safe situation, that's Wade's job. So Wade was coming in, and then we scored three in the ninth. And Johnny was fighting. He wanted to go back out. And I'm like, okay, look, you've done your job very very well tonight now we're gonna let Wade do his but keep your head in the game because we score a couple of runs I'm gonna let you go back out and we did in the middle on the left uh, two questions was Escobar bunting on his own on the fifth and yes oh, second question uh, how do you define Esky magic and was that an example of it well just uh, I mean just you know he put he finds a way to put the ball in play and you know I knew I didn't put the bunt sign on because I knew he'd be bunting on his own you know Fouled the ball off first pitch. Fouled the ball off second pitch. Moose was standing next to me. and said, just go ahead and swing away and get a single. And that's exactly what he did. You know, he just, his focus really intensifies during this time. He's a big, he's a big game player. Um, and he finds way to be, he finds ways to be successful in, in these, in this environment. I mean, the biggest environment you can be in. Um, but his focus really, really intensifies and um, he finds a way to, you know, be special during these times. Ned, right in front, Allison. How much will it um, help going into New York and having such a well-rested bullpen, especially considering also Chris Young, how much he threw yesterday? Well, uh, that was uh, that was key to score those three runs and let Johnny go back out and finish that game, not having to use anybody in the pen. Today, Wade got loose, um, Kelvin got a little loose, but it's not like coming in and pitching an inning. And with the off day tomorrow, they'll be ready to go for that three-game stretch uh, in New York. Anything else for Ned tonight? Okay, in front again. I mean, listen, the series isn't over. You know, that's it's 2-0. But confidence level, with how you guys won last night and, and how you won today, what was the, the, the clubhouse like in there? Is this Our confidence level hasn't changed from the first day of spring training to today. Our confidence has been high all year long. I mean, we expected to be here. Um, you know, we expected to compete for a world championship against a tough team. Uh, and our confidence hasn't changed from the first day of spring training to this point right now.